for Carter here. He's lost both of his matches. 3-0. Looks angry, frustrated, irritated. You name it, he's looked it. But he's had a break. We had some dinner before this session began. Has he reset the clock, as it were? We'll find out, Dominic. If he starts knocking good balls in and making a few breaks, I'm sure he'll feel fine. But as soon as things start to go wrong again, that degree of volatility may be in evidence. Perfect start from Kyron Wilson. Nicely cued. Good position on the black. Already a great chance in this first frame for him. Ford has been officiating today. The two referees have had to make their way to London ahead of the Masters, which begins tomorrow, of course, at Alexandra Palace. Thank you. 15. Now, I wonder if Kyron will play for the blue or the black here. It'll be one of the two, but he'll be thinking about going into the pack of reds and maybe from the blue. There'll be a better chance of a favourable split. Sixteen. Hit the bunch pretty much on the nose. 21. Don't think it's the best split, Dom. Well, it would be if that red that's next to the pink was available into the right corner. I'm suggesting that it's not because Kyron would be playing it by now. So he's eyeing up this long straightish red to the green pocket. Good queuing here required. But Kyron is a good queuist. Twenty-two. The current situation would have been a lot clearer had Corin Wilson not lost his most recent match. He was 2-0 up 25. against a seemingly dispirited Dave Gilbert. But Gilbert, certainly against my expectations, Dom, I'm sure yours also came back to win 3-2. That's why the, the group is still up in the air. Yes, Kyron up for all the world as I'd win that match. Just lost a couple of tight frames. Dave Gilbert spotted a beautiful red along the top cushion. Which was the last red of the last frame 30. and went on to make the winning clearance. Thirty one.
36. Seven. Kyron just have a little more angle on this blue than he would have liked, so I wonder if he'll cannon into the reds and the pink here. Delicate touch required. Exactly. Aaron's played it very delicately. Definitely has a red to the right corner. Oh, he has two reds to the right corner. The left corner, even. Sorry. Couldn't maintain position on the black. So once again, going up to the blue. This is a very good start from Kyron Wilson. All Cali. Ali Carter's done in this first frame is to break off. Looks very disinterested, let's just say that. just running on and on but Kyron still has a cut back into this left corner for tonight black pops to the three. right corner, Kyron's okay here. If the black doesn't pop to the right corner, he has a problem positionally. Very swiftly, this is fine ball. So Carter's fruitless day continues. Seven frames played, seven frames lost it would appear. Good thinking from Kyron. It's a choice of two shots here. Can cannon into the black, knock it towards the right corner. That's what he's chosen to do. 70. Oh, the next red will be a problem. But I don't think he'll mind too much. This frame's gone now from Ali Carter's point of view. Seventy-seven. 
on the way to being runner-up in Group 4, Wilson compiled six centuries. 85. Still looking for his first century in this group, though. 86. Down to three. Ninety four. Excellent. Hundred and one. Hundred and three. Hundred and six. Hundred and ten. Hundred and fifteen. Under the twenty one, under the twenty eight, wasn't under that 10, an absolutely thing. classy break? Total clearance of one hundred and twenty eight, and Karen Wilson, he wasn't. Day for him, but Karen Wilson is such a consummate professional he will not be looking at Carter he'll be thinking about winning this 3-0 now over on the other table I can tell you Martin Gould who's still in contention Tutimbo. safety from Kyron but that green and brown now are a good target to try and get in behind always dangerous to Force Kyron Wilson to have to take a pot on such a great long potter. Does he feel inclined to tempt this red to right corner? That's one of the shots of the tournament what? so far. Another golden opportunity created by Kyron Wilson.
six. Carter has felt the full weight of Wilson's scoring power in the Championship League before. When they met in Group 3 in 2018, Wilson won 3-2, making breaks of 131 and 105. 11. This is their seventh Four. meeting in the Championship League over the years. On is even right now at three wins each. Strangely, considering they've been around for a while, particularly Carter, they've only met in two matches outside of the Championship Something. League. One was a, a best of three in the WST Pro Series last season. Carter won that 2-0. And he also won 5 1 when they met in the final qualifying round of the Australian Open in 2015. Now then, after all of the excellence Callum from Wilson, Wilson, a simple one goes 17. astray. And pretty much that was the story. Now, for the first time today, can Carter show us what he's made of? Yesterday, he had a couple of really good wins. He beat Dave Gilbert 3-2. And Luning 3-1. That's far today, though. A shadow of his normal self. Yeah, he's even potted that one on the thin Seven. side. And played, I'm sure, for the red to the right of the pink. Twenty one. Twenty-two. I'd like the angle on the pink to play for the red below it, but that's why he's decided instead to screw back to the top cushion, the red to this left corner. Twenty-eight. Again, not perfect. I wonder if he'll try to come twice across the table here and play for one of the two reds just above the black. Well, he did do. He's a bit lucky there. Play to miss those reds to play them in the right corner. Thirty six. Try and knock them towards the corner pocket. Oh. 
42. Now, has this worked out for Ali? Maybe not. He has to take the red to right centre, it's tricky. Always towards that near draw. Forty-two. At no point. Kyron playing a partial swerve here, just to pop the red near the corner. One. For positional purposes. So the pink is a real examination. Tyler Wilson. Surprised. And he turned down the red to the green pocket. Oh dear, that's gone wrong as well. Thank you. Hi, Carter. Better. No. Same from the yellow. And this is looking good. Especially Eleven. because he's got to use the rest. Normally pots these for breakfast. Thank you. Didn't quite get hold of the cue ball as Twelve. much as he wanted though. Only fractionally. Accidentally left himself a perfect angle here. Mm, not quite. So, Ali Carter comes back to the Four. table 15 points ahead. One. 18 in front. Yellow comes back up, of course. And now with yellow, green, and brown. He finally won a frame today. 36. Five. Green actually is. And talking of which, Martin Gould has just spotted frame ball. Eight. Over on table two, looks like leading Looning 2 0. Top for Carter. Futility over. Martin Gould's break ended at 64. The frame Carter was conceded, and so he does lead 2 0. And... ...match. Karen Wilson and Ali Carter. They're locked together at 1-1. If you're just joining us, Wilson made a superb 128 break in the first frame. He was in again in the second and missed quite a straightforward red.
sorry, rather Ali Carter. I think I'm taking this red on to the left corner. Excellent pot. Well, hands up any of you that thought that black would go on the pink spot. Fifty. play to go into the bunch. Twenty one. Three or four loose threads though you could still play for. said that was because there would have been a chance of bringing pink and black into play. 23. One big thing in Carter's favour coming into these matches. Thirty. There go on frames one, and Carter would get the nod. So, if Karen Wilson lost this match, he'd be on three. Forty-three. He's such an attacking player; he likes to get the reds open fairly soon. But he's left it to the last minute on this occasion. Forty-four. <coughs> Yes, in the previous frame, Wilson potted a red with side. Okay. Needs to be very careful here, Ali Carter. A mistake now could be costly still. Sixty-three. He's so Seventy. 
66. Thank you. 67. What a difference, a little confidence. This from Kyron Wilson in the second frame, having played so well in the first. Thank you. And Carter, 70 on the frame. Well, the break ended at 70, and because of the Wilson concession, so did the... change now they're back to Wilson Carter and he has a much better chance of potting this now that he's established a 2-1 lead in this match beautifully cued yes he controlled as well for position on the blue what I'm sure that red that's above the black or whether the red has actually just nudged it off it. Now there's your answer. I think Ali tried to just fractionally cannon it there. And if that red isn't on to the left corner. Ali Carter, 40. So 2-1 on both sides of the curtain. One of these difficult reds on to the left corner. Very risky, no path back to bulk here that I can see. Oh, did he take one on there? Or did that keyboard just drift? thought he was toast but somehow he's rediscovered his mojo 8 9 And of course, Tom, given his pedigree, given his career CV and what he's achieved, <coughs> it's quite possible he could go on and win the whole group. 60. And that would be stunning. Oh, of course, Sally Carter's more than capable of that feat. Twice world finalist, losing both times to O'Sullivan. 70. is the most twenty five. 
lost in the winners group final 3-2 against the player on the other side of the arena here Martin Gould now I don't think he's on that red he isn't Ali Carter 31 Surely that red doesn't pass either one, does it? No. Containing safety. And that was clever thinking from Ali Carter because it's enabled him to tie up a red. Yes, which will be immediately untied. Weak safety shot, though. Cue ball only just trickling into Borg. He's going to defeat Looning 3-1. That means, at the very worst, for Martin Gould, he's going to be back for Group 6. The first time Kyron's had a chance to look at a potential pot. If he hits it on the thin side, he'll probably cannon the red that's on the top cushion. Oh, that was so close. A great effort. But the worst possible outcome for Kyron. 57, 64, and a clinching 88. Martin Gould did beat Looning 3 1. So Looning is going to finish at the foot of the table. At the very least, tournament. And it looks as though. Carter wins this. Seven. So it was a, a P super in terms 14. of all the permutations we couldn't really see our way through could we but now it's all quite clear 50 Carter needs the black and one more red <coughs> begin to find your A game second it's an elementary red, and ever since, Carter's had second wind. Thirty. The match is well and truly sealed, and so therefore Thirty. is the fate of Dave Gilbert. He's out of the tournament. Martin Gould will finish fifth, 37. so he'll be back the week after next. 38. The playoffs will be contested by Jordan Brown, Scott Donaldson, Corin Wilson, and like a phoenix from the ashes, 
Ali Carter. 44. So there it is. When he needed to, he came good. It's been a, a poor day for Carter, apart from the last three frames there.